Back in March of 1992, Microsoft began selling their new 16-bit operating system, Windows 3.1, which was the successor of Windows 3. Before the days of the start menu, Microsoft had an application called the Program Manager, which was introduced back in Windows 3. This program allowed users to launch other programs without having to use a command line. Multitasking was also supported in Windows 3.1. Users could use the task list to switch between applications, and the task list even had an option to tile applications, and this is similar to how we look at Windows Snap in newer versions of Windows. This menu provided access to the task list, or users could press Control Escape as a keyboard shortcut. Other apps, such as Windows Write, were included with Windows 3.1. Windows Write provided basic word processing capabilities. Windows 3.1 also ushered in the true type era for Windows. Windows 3.1 also came with a paint program. Although it is known as Paint today, it was known as Paintbrush back in the day. Since Windows was quickly making its way to personal computers, Microsoft wanted to make the system easy to use. So not only did they have a cleaner interface compared to other versions of Windows, but they included some very useful tutorials that helped customers learn how to use the environment. And if you were really lost in using the help application, you can even look up help on how to use the help application. You know, just in case. And of course, what would Windows be without some fun colors for users to customize their environment with? So there you have it, a quick tour of Microsoft Windows 3.1.